I also found that you did, you were part of a paper, uh, postdoctoral, you did um, research in heart and muscle cells and uh, statins. Um, yeah. And as an article of uh, co uh, cholesterol depletion on cardiomyocytes. Um, so just how important is cholesterol to the body? Oh, it's vitally important. That's why I left science, because I didn't agree with um, cholesterol lowering drugs, because cholesterol is a messenger, not a monster. And it's sort of pivotal, first of all, for the integrity of cell membranes. Um, it help, it's a part of the barrier on our skin. We make all of our sex hormones out of pregnenolone, which is made from cholesterol. Then we make vitamin D out of cholesterol in the presence of ultraviolet light. Also, cholesterol is really important for timing in the body. So it's, some people would refer to it as a time crystal um, because it's important for seasonal changes because it absorbs green light and UV light so, so it can alter our hormones seasonally. But also it's important for um, chromosome division and gene expression. And if there isn't enough cholesterol, uh, the timing in which our genes are switched on and off and chromosomes dividing can be off. And that's obviously a recipe for cancer. And even um, the, even the Framington Heart Study uh, showed the link between uh, low LDL and higher rates of cancer, yet their big study was desperate to prove that cholesterol was bad. Um, so all this other study, say, with Ansel Keys and further sort of demonization of cholesterol and saturated fat couldn't be further from the truth. So that's why I left science, because I just didn't want to work on something I didn't think was helpful for, for people. And even if you look at the um, overall sort of um, efficacy of statins, I think people live five minutes longer in a study. And there are so many side effects to statins, which lower cholesterol. But then I haven't listed all of cholesterol's um, roles in the body uh, by any means. So we can imagine if we lower it, we actually create lots of problems. I mean, there are studies on, you know, um, students and people in prison, um, a captive audience, and they show that low cholesterol can lead to mood swings, um, violent behavior, depression. It, it makes people more likely to have neurodegenerative problems because 25% of the brain is cholesterol. Um, so again, it's something really important, how it functions alone, but also what the body turns it into. And then there's another important aspect of cholesterol, which is sulfated cholesterol or cholesterol sulfate. And this um, can be water soluble. And this has um, benefits in actually an anti-clotting activity. And so it's anti um, athlo uh, genic, so it's beneficial for heart problems. I'm talking about the cholesterol sulfate. So I think um, I've kind of listed here how important cholesterol is, and we shouldn't be fiddling about with it because it's that important. Our body makes a, a lot of it. So uh, that's sort of briefly my my view in defence of cholesterol.